Almost all of us have wondered if iPads and iPhones are addicting, and not just for us, but even for children. A new report says more than one-third of parents use their tablets or smartphones to entertain their kids, even though more than half of them worry it could be harmful. ABC's Juju Chang takes a look at babies and just how young all of this is starting. Try 10 days old. Just 10 days out of the womb. Watch Alex Brooks fixate on a screen. He's completely enthralled. His mom props him up in oh, front yeah. of the iPad He's for what she hopes enthralled. is a good reason. I guess I just didn't think it was going to hurt. So why not give it a try? And he seemed to like it. YouTube features plenty of babies who can't even talk. Ah but are giving a recital <laughs> or launching just the right app. Show me Word World. Okay. Right there. Oh. Okay. Right there. Good job. Yeah. For the diaper set, tapping and swiping is second nature. So he could swipe even at sort of yeah, nine uh, months old. Oh yeah, before that even, I would say. Probably when he was like six or seven months old. Urvashi Sen's new mommy group say they all feel conflicted about exposing their infants so early. I feel kind of guilty when he's sitting there with it, but at the same time, I know that I'm going to get him to eat dinner if I give him the iPad. I do think that there is real learning and value. But given the choice between mommy and a touch screen, which would these babies choose? We decided to put it to the test. Do you want your mommy or your iPad? What would you rather have? Leo. Leo. <laughs> yeah. Time after time. You're going to go to mommy or to the digital <laughs> toy? Mommy? You kind of lost dad on that one. I know. The same seemingly irresistible pull. So here, look, you want a toy? You want all the, look at all these toys. Look at all these toys that you have over here. <laughs> yeah, not so much. But should parents be concerned? These young kids need to be developing language skills and learning to recognize a facial expression and not scanning the internet on an iPad. The key, experts say, is not to use the tablet as an electronic babysitter, but as a teaching tool. What you draw on, bumpkin? Interact with your child as they use the devices. Yo-yo. Research shows toddlers can learn from programs like age-appropriate video games. Oh, yeah. And little Alex, that 10-day-old infant, now one-year-old, still transfixed by the iPad. It's a toy he's not growing out of anytime soon. Juju Chang, ABC News, New York. And we're going to be reading everything you tell us online. Let us know what you think.